I have a bone to pick with Lamar men's basketball team. Fellas, you know the news comes at the beginning of the games and I have to get back for the show to put it together. I need you to put up these points early so I can put them in the show. After I leave, five Cardinals scored in double figures as Lamar University overcame a slow start to defeat rival McNeese 86-80. to Coach Price, talk to your boys. And with that win, our guys still have a chance to gain some momentum in conference play. I'm calling it hashtag LU comeback season. Seniors, Colton Weisbrod and Joey Frenchwood led the way with 19 points. After the game, head coach Tick Price explained how this guy shared the ball. Everyone was going to work. 32 points in the paint. But I need to see the guys gut check the competition early. Come out with the alley. You dunk it in their face. I see our cats coming out during warm ups. Let them know whose house this is. This game was won at the free throw line. Big Red made 30 points behind the charity stripe. Now, even with three straight three pointers by the Cowboys, LU still came out on top. The Cardinals play Abilene Christian on Wednesday. They win 86 to 80. But the ladies, they showed out. Mo Kennard scored 24 points to lead four Lamar University Cardinals in double figures. LU led 21 to 16 after the first quarter before opening the second quarter on a 7 to 0 run. This wouldn't be an easy game early on. Cowgirls tried to get buck wild, but that suffocating defense, the girls couldn't breathe. 29 turnovers by McNeese. The 23rd straight win at home extends a program record. Head coach Robin Harmony never thought the blue had the red beat at any point. Twice we had the lead and they came back at us and it took us a while to really stretch it. Um, but at no time were they really out of the game. It makes me go harder. Opponents are tough on the rebounds, and they had some really tough post players. And I just wanted to be aggressive, box out, and just get the points. They score, I push them. When I score, they push me. They tell me hit the next one, I tell them hit the next one. It's a win-win. Stronger at my mid-range game than I am my outside game, but uh, I never shy away from taking the three. The Cardinals go for their 24th straight win at 7 p.m. on Wednesday and the second of four straight home games as LU as they host Abilene Christian. And Lamar Athletics has confirmed that former head coach John Payton has passed away. Payton became the first African-American coach at Lamar University. He was a highly successful football, basketball, and track coach at Woodville Scott High School and Beaumont's Charlton Pollard High School. Now, staying in Beaumont, Ozan swimmer Darian Morgan won first place in the 200-yard breaststroke and also second place in another event. Now, I might want to challenge Morgan in the water, see if he has those skills, but can't be that fast, though. I'm pretty busy doing the show, so I probably couldn't do it. Congrats, young man. And could some of our Newton Eagles be horn Frogs? Run it back. Darwin Barlow, quarterback Joshua Foster, and wide receiver Noah Williams, and also Tamiza Brown wouldn't make that much of a jersey change because they're rocking that purple. Have fun out there, fellas, at TCU. Make sure you follow me on social media. That's how I found those pictures. You can do it real easy. I like to talk fashion. I like to talk sports. I like to talk movies. Black Panther coming out soon. Very excited about that. So good stuff going on. Twitter, Instagram. Don't do the Snapchat, though. Not a big Snapchat guy. Oh, no. Do you do the Snapchat? Oh, sometimes. What, what do you know about fashion? I mean, do we have to point out? I mean, you just yes, asked me uh, before the show. She said, Jay, do you have every color flower? I'm yeah. like, not every color. I was telling him he should wear like a purple flower. If I can wear a gold dress and it can be LSU colors. You know, you're making everyone mad right now. These LU fans out there. Hey, LU, hey, what, LU, you? hey that was a pretty good game. That was a good game. I love how you tried to get out of that, though, to say you're LSU and now you're saying Hey, I like are. LSU and LU. You know, the only difference is there's no S in there. All right, so if they play against each other, who are you going for? I would have to say LSU. Sorry, but <laughs> hey, I love LU, too. <laughs> well, thanks, Jay.